All right, brethren. All right, uh, beloved brothers and sisters. You might want to sit down for this one and get yourself a cup of coffee or some uh, a cup of tea. Oh, the movie industry, Satan, the demonic uh, entities, how Satan has uh, infiltrated not only the uh, movie industry, and but also the music industry. How many have I been preaching on have come out and uh, admitted that uh, for fame and fortune, they sold their soul to Lucifer, to the devil. They made a blood ritual. Uh, a blood pact with the devil. They sold their soul for a moment of fame and a moment of uh, fortune. We see people that seem like they're never going to end. Their career never ends. You've got, um, and I don't know off the top of my head how old uh, Mick Jagger is, but um, I wonder if I could do a search on that real quick. And uh, he looks like, like the epitome of health. He gets around and jumps around on the stage. He's got to be in his 80s. Like uh, a young gymnast. I moved from this chair into the living room and, and I can't breathe. I can't. My whole body hurts. I just took some Tylenol uh, because I'm in so much pain. But he jumps around like it's like he's a teenager just like he did back in the heyday of the Rolling Stones. Keith Richards, a chain smoker, chain smoking one cigarette after the other, and his face is weather beaten. He's got what they, what I call, a, not a poker face, a smoker's face. You can see the lines in the, from the smoke, the years of smoking, and he's still, he's still going strong. What is driving these people? Um, we've heard of so many famous people selling their souls to the devil, but one person you wouldn't think a whole lot about, Barry Manilow. Whoa, whoa, Pastor Dave, get your coffee. Not Barry Manilow. In a, a beautiful song, like, um, I write the songs. Hold on, Pastor Dave. No, no, no. Slow down on the medication. Slow down on the time a little, Pastor Dave. But we can understand Mick Jagger and Symphony Symphony for the Devil. Look at that. The devil speaking through Mick Jagger. Please allow me to introduce myself. I'm a man of wealth and taste. I've been around for a long, long year. Sent many a man's soul to waste. I was around, around when Jesus Christ had his moment of doubt and pain. Pleased to meet you. Won't you guess my name? We know it's the devil speaking. These people, I believe, have been possessed, not so much by demons, but by Lucifer himself, the devil himself. Oh, but Pastor Dave, Barry Manilow, did you ever stop to think and really listen to the words of his most famous song that everyone loved and enjoyed. We see the craziness in the movie industry, uh, the music industry, how they've lost their minds with uh, all types of derangement syndromes. They've lost their minds. But Barry Manilow, he doesn't look like he's aged. There's another one. He's got to be 90. And he's singing... I write the songs that made the whole world sing. Let's look at the lyrics. And then you decide who is singing, who is actually singing through Barry Manilow. Let me see if I can pull this up. And uh, I want you to read it along with me. Hopefully I can do this and not lose my spot. I write the songs by Barry Manilow. Listen to me now, children of God. I've been alive forever. We got to understand when we think of Halloween is coming and the devil and Satan, uh, the devil ugly and red with, with a pitchfork and horns on his head. Lucifer was one of Abba Father's. Adonai's 
most beautiful of all creations. He headed the music industry, amen? And every time he moved, music played. And here's the lyrics. Listen to me now. These are the actual lyrics. I've been alive forever. And I wrote the very first song. I put the words and the melodies together. I am music. And I write the songs. He is music. Lucifer is the devil is music. I write the songs that make the whole world sing. Be careful now who you follow and who you listen to in the music industry. I write the songs of love and special things. I write the songs that make the young girls cry. I write the songs. I write the songs. My home lies deep within you. This should give you chills. Now that the hair is standing up on your arms. And I've got my own place in your soul. Very minimal now. Or is it the devil? Now when I look out through your eyes, I'm young again. Even though I'm very old. This should have the hair standing up. Share this video out, please. Please get the word out. Share this video. If you've ever shared anything from me before, share this out. I write the songs that make the whole world sing. I write the songs of love and special things. No one would think very mental. I write the songs that make the young girls cry. I write the songs. I write the songs. Oh, my music makes you dance and gives your spirit to take a chance. My goodness. And I wrote some rock and roll so you can move music fills your heart well that's a real fine place to start oh my goodness it's from me it's for you it's from you it's from me it's a worldwide symphony i write the songs that make the whole world sing i write the songs of love and special things I write the songs that make the young girls cry. I write the songs. I write the songs. I am music. And I write the song. My, my, my. Brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters. How I've tried to warn you all to be aware. Not to be woke, but to be awake. It's hidden right before our very eyes. Satan, he's coming. But so is Jesus. So is Jesus. Who would have ever thought Barry Manilow? No one would have ever questioned that song. But take a deeper look. Let God fill your heart with love. And let him fill you with knowledge knowledge and understanding because we're in the late hour and jesus he's coming praise the lord thank you jesus if you find it in your heart to give a gift to our ministry to keep videos like this going and to keep our homeless outreach going paypal cash app pd zacker all the links will be in the drop down below share this now